Hello guys, I'm back again with another video. So as I promised in my last one, when the new beta comes out, I will make an update for it and I'll show you what's everything new in it. So here I am. The beta update came uh, a couple of hours ago with the size of 272 megabytes, as you can see on that screenshot I took. So uh, there are uh, many uh, stability changes. I mean, the beta is now uh, very stable till the betas now they were just uh, making the base for how android 7 will look like and now they're just making it uh, more stable and stable so uh, there are almost uh, no changes in the os um, as you can see fixed causes cases are samsung notes has been removed uh, you can still download it from the uh, play store if you want and that the other bugs are fixed and stability improvements um, I will show you for example on the previous betas you can see how many fixed cases there were there were unresolved problems uh, on the second one this was uh, for the Facebook error so uh, there are a couple minor changes which I'm going to show you for example in the settings app when you go to uh, advanced features you can now see when I tap on advanced features there is new animations in almost every system app that swipe from right to left in three to one you can see that wasn't here before so now there is quick dial which was previous in the galaxy apps so uh, by pressing and holding the home key while on any screen you just say a contact name and we will dial it uh, that is the first of the changes. Uh, the second one, which is very, very minor, but I managed to see it. Uh, when you go to about device, software info, there is Android version, but below it, previously on previous betas, there was uh, SE version, which was Samsung Experience version. Now that is gone. It cannot be found anywhere. So uh, it used to be below Android version. Uh, from the last beta, the Android security patch is uh, the last one from 1st of December. That is very nice that we keep getting custom security updates. Um, basically almost everything is the same, there is not uh, anything to cover. Um, there was a bug for me in the always on display and I'm not sure if it was me or it was everyone who is using the Nougat beta when for example on Spotify when I play music on Spotify when I walk the phone then uh, I wasn't able to control the music but uh, now with double tap I can uh, that's the case for third party apps I was able to control it in the stock music app but from Spotify I wasn't able now I, it's fixed probably I'm not sure if it's only me with that bug uh, but whatever the case is now it's fixed so uh, many many stability improvements uh, are here now uh, it feels a lot smoother a lot nicer to use uh, that new animation for which I told you in whatever menu you go it just swipes so that is it guys nothing uh, much to cover but uh, whenever a new update comes out i'll make another video and keep you up to date with the latest samsung nougat beta program thanks for watching